example in this sentence patna is a city on the banks of river ganges so we are referring to a particular city that is patna and a particular river also that is ganges so in this sentence patna and ganges are proper nouns and the word city and the word river are common nouns all right so we move on to the next type of nouns uh, before that we'll take up another example that is uh, the here is the example the child is walking with tommy his pet dog now in this example we are talking about a child but the child has not been named whereas the dog has been named the name of the dog is tommy so tommy is a proper noun and child and dog these two words are common nouns all right now here we need to note a very important thing the first letter whenever we write down a proper noun the first letter of every proper noun is always written in capitals all right so next we move on to the other kind of noun that are common nouns so what are common nouns and we had seen in the earlier examples also these are the names given in common or general to every person animal place or thing belonging to the same class or kind now for example here is the sentence the bird is very upset now we, here we are talking about a noun that is bird but we have not named the bird in general we are talking about any bird so here the word bird is a common noun now in the next example the children are playing here we are talking about the children but we have not used any specific name for children so here the word children is a common noun all right now we move on to the next type of nouns and that are collective nouns now what do we mean by the word collective now here the word collective means a group or a collection of something whenever we refer to these group or collections of some people animals or things as a whole these are known as collective nouns now let us take up some some examples now for example the crowd was shouting so here